Hi everybody and welcome back to another screencast for Dummies Linux 2012 here on the Total OS Today channel. I am going to answer some frequently asked questions about Linux. Now these are some questions that I needed answered years ago when I was first starting off with Linux. Okay, question number one. Can you try a Linux based operating system such as Ubuntu, what I have here? in front of me can you try this without installing it absolutely you can you can go into what's called proceed into what's called a live user session off a CD or DVD that has Ubuntu basically what you do is reboot your computer so that it reads the operating system off the disk go into live session mode you can browse the operating system try it without installing it it is completely safe Question number two, how do you install Ubuntu? Well, the way that I like to do it, I like to operate a computer in a dual install or dual boot install. For example, uh, if you were downloading Ubuntu, you would choose the option to install alongside Windows 7 and then follow the on-screen prompts, follow the install. It is really dummies proof in my opinion. And by the way, this works for either Windows 7, Windows Vista, Windows XP. You can install Linux alongside your Windows-based operating system and then reboot your computer, which you will see on your screen the option to load into either Linux or Windows. Question number three. If you do not like Linux, such as Ubuntu, what if you don't like it and want to delete it? Well, you can safely delete it. What I do usually is, as far as uh, Windows goes, I downloaded a free piece, uh, free piece of software called ECBCD. I redo or rewrite the master boot record. Uh, this allows me to reboot and uh, just boot into Windows 7. You're not quite done yet. There is, uh, There are a few extra steps going into the disk management tools to safely delete Linux. Uh, that being said, before you install anything, make sure you back up everything. Okay, and I'll have a video of that uh, in this series sometime in the future. I have done a video like that in the past, but I'll keep doing these to make it easier for you. Finally, what's the best, the best, uh, the best Linux-based operating system? Well, it's the one that works best for you. No, I am not trying to be funny. Right now, if I had to pick one, I pick Zorn OS. The latest one is Zorn OS 5.2. I like that because at least it looks like Windows 7 and if it looks comfortable you're probably going to like it. Keep in mind that it is Linux and not Windows. All right, finally, if you need more information, I have two uh, web, sent, uh, web links or web websites here. To the left is the totalostoday.blogspot.com. There is a help forum at the bottom and it really I, I made both of these websites about as dummies proof uh, as easy as possible nothing flashy just uh, information uh, about technology in general if you would prefer to listen rather than look you can certainly go to the Toscast podcast website and listen to the audio portions of some of the podcasts including the exclusive Linux A Team podcast uh, we hope to be doing another one here maybe two weeks from now and I am toying around with the idea uh, of the idea with a Windows 18 podcast exclusively for Windows users alright that's it for this one thank you so much for watching welcome aboard all the new subscribers I try to answer all the comments and questions if I miss any and I know I, I do I apologize if you have any questions let me know Thank you for watching, and you know, as always, I will catch you guys sometime in the future.